Quickly to 30 love. Power from Mary Pierce likes to hit the ball very hard off of both sides. Needs to harness that power and be more consistent. Ingus wraps in an ace, her first. Perfectly. Didn't take a big backswing here. Didn't have time for it on this second serve. Just gets her shoulder turn very well. The ball out in front on the. serving for the first set. Ingus comes in and knocks it off. Yeah. She always seems to be there. Yeah. I must say, though, I think sometimes uh, she can use a few of the littler steps to get on balance right before she hits. I mean, that's being nitpicky, but... Uh, Especially at the French this year. I didn't think her footwork was as superb as it usually is. And Hingis has the first set in hand. Six games to three. Mary Pierce to serve, opening the second set. Another one of those swinging volleys. Such, such great instincts. Any for Hingis, <laughs> you know, that kind of attitude. But it does uh, rub some of the players the wrong way some of the time. I think that last smile was for a name. You know, you thought the other one was out. And Martina Hingis has really been on cruise control this whole tournament. Now, Hingis. Jim, she, she knows that uh, she has to stay really fit in order to maintain that number one ranking. Everybody's hungry. We have Venus Williams coming up quickly. Now that's the kind of thing that irritates the players yeah. when they when their ball's going out and they kind of take a, a yeah. half swing, that's pretend a, they're going to hit it. That's a public park kick. Thing. Yeah. I think Mary showed it with that forehand that she was a little upset. Oh. That'll work. Her seventh Seven. ace. I Good return again from Pierce. A three-setter in doubles right after her three-setter against Sellis. So she needs to like, get a massage, just relax. Good night's sleep. Go to bed early tonight. Yeah. 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 that time from Pierce. Pearson can 
control and that pays off. Once in this set, great serving. Great returning. She went for it. Well played by Mary Pierce. Not all the way there. You can't hit it with 100% power. First ace of the night, a big one here at 3015. Made a good serve, set that one away. Well served game by Mary Pierce. 5 4, she leads on serve. In Here at La Costa, Martina Hingis. Larger than. I'll have to check that for tomorrow. I think it's somewhere around 29 inches, something like that. It certainly has changed the game. I think that it's been great for women's tennis. You see Turn to La Costa. Oh. On the line. 30 left for Hingis. has gone down to courtside to talk with the winner of this event, the semifinal. Return of second serve. Hingis with a dandy. And stretched out. Pierce can't keep it in the court. 4-3.
Ing is just too good. consecutive great shots including a clean winner. Serves coming to Hingis. Another match point for her. making in this tie break by both players. Thank you, Mark. Now Pierce with a match uh, with a uh, set point, pardon me. Total control, so you've got to give Mary Pierce even more credit for fighting her way back into this match. With the backhand volley to win the opening game of the third and knee injury. And I talked to Michael Vian last week in Florida. Number two, she doesn't try for dumb shots if she feels that she can hang in the points. And Good return from Hingis. Hingis 
just wide. He's Setting three seeds on our way to the championship, including the defending champion and top ranked player in the world. Strangest points leading up to this shot. Hingis Shank, the return of serve, had a lot of spin, and Mary applied the shot with a lot of spin. And I honestly don't think that Mary Pierce meant to hit Martine Hingis. She was off balance on that overhead. Serving for the match when we return. Sends her to the final. The frustrated Martina Hingis, who sailed through the tournament until this match here tonight. The second set was her undoing. She was unable to close out with three match point opportunities. We'll be back to talk to the winner.